Fast approaching and while many internship opportunities for the season may already be filled, it is the perfect time to start thinking about plans for the fall. Andrew Penalva is with the, he's the director of the workforce development at the Indiana Latino Institute and he's here with us this morning to talk about opportunities, specifically paid internships for college students. That's amazing. Yeah, so at the Indiana Latino Institute, also known as ILI, we bring in a new cohort of interns every summer, fall, and spring, and we make sure that these students are getting compensated for their time. So you're pairing these students up with, what, different businesses, opportunities around the state? Yeah, so we work um, all across the state, and what we do is we, when we bring in that new cohort of Latino college students, we connect them to partners that we have in the area so that they can get their internship for the particular semester and then we make sure that we give them reinforcements during it to make sure they do a good job and at the end we award them a scholarship. For anyone who's not familiar with the Indiana Latino Institute, can you explain what the mission is? Sure, so the Indiana Latino Institute, we are headquartered here in Indianapolis but we do work all across the state and the mission of ILI is really to advance Latino educational attainment and workforce preparedness and one of the ways that we do this is through our Office of Workforce Development and this internship programming. Yeah, pairs perfectly with internships. Why are these so important? So internships are important because you know you need to so many entry-level jobs now are requiring experience mm -hmm. and how are you supposed to get that experience and one of the great ways to do it is while you're in school uh, doing that internship they can also, you know, they help beef up your resume, they give you experience, they build your network, so when it comes time to maybe apply for that job or ask for a letter of recommendation, your network has grown so much now that you have people that you can count on. And we were discussing, it used to be hard sometimes to intern because you weren't necessarily paid, but you guys kind of make sure that these interns are covered while getting that experience. Exactly, yeah, so what we do is there are some unpaid internships out there and if they are what we do is we award those students a scholarship to compensate them for that time but if it's a paid internship what we also do is we make sure that the students are going to make a minimum hourly amount and so if that means us supplementing the rate that the employer is providing we go ahead and do that so one way or another the students get to make sure that they get paid for that experience what's that minimum amount if you don't uh, mind me asking seventeen dollars and fifty cents and who's eligible for this so to be eligible for this program, you need to be um, in college, in Indiana, and a resident of Indiana, and you also need to be Latino. Okay, and do you have to have a certain GPA? Yeah, so there is a minimum 2.5 GPA that we, that we require to be a part of the program, and also we ask that all students need to be in good academic standing as well at the time of application. You have a summer program as well. That one is full, but now is the time to apply for this. When do they need to get that application in by? So the application for fall, the fall semester, is June 30th of this year. And so, yeah, this program has grown and grown and become so popular that now it's filling up months and months ahead of time. And so, yeah, our summer cohort is full, but right now we're accepting applications for the fall 2024 semester through June 30th. And on July 1st, we'll open the application for spring. Any uh, final advice to anyone maybe watching right now thinking about doing the program? What would you encourage them to know? I would encourage these students, especially you know, in the Latino community, it's one of the youngest, fastest growing in Indiana. And students that do internships, data shows that they make more after graduation, they have an easier time finding job, jobs after graduation. And so take advantage of this opportunity when you have someone like the Indiana Latino Institute who's going to be able to kind of walk you through this process. If you've never done it, we're here to help and we'll help with resumes, mock interviews, and connecting you to the opportunities as well. Sounds like a great opportunity. Andrew, thank you so much. My pleasure. Thank you for having me.